What is good? Diamond Dynasty, baby. Y'all already know what's going on in this video today. We all know what's going on right now with Chris Leslie, host Sway. Okay, the case of the ex. She got the case of the ex. And I feel like we've all been there. Leslie did take to her Instagram, okay? And she said, I see my true supporters so much clearer. When I see this, I was like, oh Lord Jesus, here we go. She said, I see my true supporters so much clearer. Thank you. I've exposed and shared my life with everyone in the only way I know how. Genuine. And for y'all, I will share a few things that's happened. So she did shortly delete this. I think I seen it up for like an hour and then she deleted it. A lot of you guys were like, man, go watch the Chris versus my ex video again. You know, and I, the first time I reacted to it on my second channel, the Diamond Life 2.0, um, I saw some things that really stood out and I was like, dang, okay, Leslie probably is not over her ex. But anyway, guys, let's get into the video. Let's see what's going on. Okay, guys. You can ask oh, I forgot to let y'all know too. I got my fried fish right here, motherfucking uh, fries, motherfucking tortoise sauce in this bitch, you know what I'm saying? We went to Texas Roadhouse yesterday. And she was fire as fuck, okay? I've been sleeping, but anyway. I don't know what, whichever order you see. Anyway. Top to bottom, baby. Make sure you love one. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Oh, I'm gonna say that. Wait, I truly believe, once again, Leslie wasn't going out there to try to, you know what I'm saying? I don't think the collab happened to be petty towards her exes. People are definitely going to say that they were being petty towards their exes. I don't think so. Okay. Now, is it a possibility that Leslie wanted to make Josue jealous? That's possible. Especially with the way that things are unfolding. Possibly. All right. But I'm going to say that I don't think she initially went out there to fall in love, to motherfucking have anything real. You know, Chris put the sauce on her. I said that a long time ago. Chris put the motherfucking sauce on her. It was a special sauce. She fell for the sauce. She liked the taste of it. And, you know, she ended up falling for Chris. But it's kind of like... Have you ever been in a situation where, you know, you met somebody new, you kind of fucking with them, you know what I'm saying? You like them, but they not your ex type shit, you feel me? So I feel like that was one of them things. And then, you know, she did state on multiple occasions that Chris made her feel like um, he wasn't ready for a relationship, which, you know, she was probably like, well, if that's the case, if uh, like, if there's a possibility that I could be dealing with some bullshit with Chris, I might as well go back to my ex. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below how you guys feel. Um, we just never know. In that Q&A that she did, the last Q&A that she did, guys, I felt like she kept it real. She did keep it real. Did she go into the specifics? No. All right? And at the time, everybody was praising, for, praising her for not going into the specifics because it's her personal life and personal business. And now people are like, oh, she should have kept it real. She should have told it all. But if she would have told it all, people would have been bashing her still saying, oh, you shouldn't have put you, uh, her in Chris's business. You just can't win for losing on this social media shit, man. Who's a better kisser? Mm -hmm. She thought about that shit and she laughing too. She laughing too. I don't, I don't know. Her. I didn't even know these questions on here. I swear to God, I don't know these questions. I was just now seeing them like, yo, she just sent it to me. This shit good, y'all. All right. Look at that. Look at that. Who's more romantic? Look at that. More romantic. Oh. 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 Let's tell it then. That's not fair. Yeah, I, I know. We did that for your video. It's not, not fair because we haven't been together. Oh. Um, just been working, working, working. You can tell that nigga really like her. That's a better smile. Ooh, the better smile. <laughs> Um, you know what? When I watched this video the first time, I was like, damn, I could tell Chris was hurt by some of the responses. Because he really liked that girl, man. He really do. <laughs> he really do. Who <laughs> is stronger? Let's look at some ketchup. She got some ketchup, y'all. What? Who smells better? Be real. 
Be real. Damn, that's tough. <laughs> that's tough, cuz. <laughs> What's tartar sauce? Mmm. 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 <laughs> she ain't gonna survive through this, y'all. I'm choking over here. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that's so I'm gonna finish it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Let's this bitch acting it's up. It's so good, too. Time too. Okay. Who do you feel like you could trust the most? Um. Oh, your social, your bank card information. Oh no, <laughs> no, not when too that. far. Uh, if we were both too close to you, who would you say yes to? That says it all for me, y'all. <clears throat> um, that really says it all for me. If Chris and Josue proposed, who would she say yes to? She she hurried up and picked up that cup, y'all. Josue, she hurried up. So if we paid attention, she has not gotten over Josue, you know? And that's one of the main reasons why she said she wasn't re ready to be in a relationship. You know, with Chris, you know, and working on themselves. She even Chris was like, he even understood. You know, she's not over her ex really. She's still healing from that, or whatever the case may be. You know, here we go again. Oh, you, who would you say yes? Here we go. I'm in the video right here, yo. Right here. Uh, if we were both too close to you, who would you say yes to? She's dead ass. She's dead ass, B. Dead ass, son. <laughs> She's dead ass. They're gonna kill you for this one. I said they gonna kill you for this one. Drink! Chris really feels some type of way about that. <laughs> what is so funny? You're laughing at yourself because I'm not laughing at you. I'm laughing at you. Now hurry up and drink. Oh! <laughs> My nigga, man, bro. Not drink from either one of these. You have to drink from one. You already I did, huh? I don't know you long enough, and this guy hurt me. It doesn't matter from you what you like. You have to go back. By the time we spent together, from the time we all spent together, who would you uh, propose to? You can't compare them. If you had to pick right now, if you, me and him was right here just sitting with each other, as you have to choose between these two to marry. That's hard, Chris. Because y'all spend more time with each other. Yeah, and I, we haven't spent enough time. You can't compare it. Okay, so drink out of, drink some, drink It's not out. a fair comparison. <laughs> you know, you want to. <laughs> all right, we're just going to end it there, guys. That's all we need to see. Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Her IG story post makes it seem like she's finna come out with a video telling what the fuck she finna tell. I don't know if she finna tell, you know, some stuff that Chris had done. And finally let the cat out the bag. I really don't know. But all I'm saying is I wish both of them the best on their solo journeys, whatever they choose to do going forward. If she want to go back to her ex, hey, it is what it is. If Chris want to hang from a tree, it is what it is. If he wants to have 20,000 bitches in his house, he can do that, all right? Um, it's life. And life goes on. All right, let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below, man. I really honestly feel like Leslie did not go into this collab trying to fall for this nigga. But like I said, he sauced her up and pretty much she liked the sauce, she liked the taste of it. And she wanted to eat it and she wasn't ready to let go of the other dish that she had, you know, in the past. 
So it is what it is, man. Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, make sure you hit that bell to be notified when I upload on this channel. Make sure you DM me lit videos to react to and tell a friend and tell a friend. Tell that ancient mama, tell that uncle Joey still a hoe. I will see you guys in the next mother, oh my God, freaking video. I lay out, man. Peace. We out there.